Next up on the CBS Sports Training Camp Tour, the Pittsburgh Steelers. Pat Firemuth, perhaps one of the most underrated tight ends in the league, could have a monster year and year three in the Berg. He's recorded 60-plus receptions in his first two seasons, looking to make history doing that for a third season. The Penn State product was named the CBS Sports' all-under-25 offensive team, and he's expected to just get better and better as he builds up chemistry with QB Kenny Pickett. Firemuth spoke with our crew at Steelers training camp in Latrobe, PA. Let's take a listen. Well, Pat, first of all, thanks for taking a little time uh -huh. with us. Year three, man. Yeah. Uh, it's, it's wild to think. Yeah. I'm curious, from your perspective, how life as a player has changed over the course of year one out on that field here at St. Vincent to where we are now in year three. Yeah, it's changed a lot. Obviously, we had a lot of turnover um, on our offense and stuff like that. And I think the biggest thing for me especially is just um, just taking care of my body. I mean, I was when I was a rookie, I kind of, um, you know, kind of just wanted all my time in the room and lay down and kick my feet up. But now it's more of you know, doing the extra rehab and stuff like that. So that's probably the biggest difference for me. Off season, from a football perspective, yeah. from a tight end perspective, what were your priorities? Yeah, just uh, you know, getting connected with some of the guys in the league and, and, and learning from them. Um, you know, I went, ended up going to tight end U and learn from Travis Kelsey and, and Kittle and, and Greg Olson and all the all the guys that are elite at the position. And, just learn different things I can I can take in my game. What if if there was one or two that that you feel like really resonated with you as you get ready for the for this season? Yeah, I think Kelsey made a really good point. Uh, just making sure everything looks the same, uh, whatever route you run, making sure it looks like another route that you run in your and in, in your offense. So that was that really stuck with me. You have great perspective because year one was Ben's last mm -hmm. year. Year two was the transition slash competition yeah. with Mitch and, and Kenny. And now year three, it's yeah. Kenny 100%. Yeah. How would you describe the difference in, in that in that whole path that we, we found ourselves on? Yeah, man, you're going from an 18-year-old, I mean, 18-year vet uh, Hall of Fame guy to, to a, a rookie. And it, it's been it's been awesome, um, you know, just kind of learning from Ben and then taking that into uh, approach with Kenny and just seeing the differences with them and just kind of learning from Kenny and his little nuances in the offense and stuff. And it's been awesome and it's been, it's been cool to uh, learn from the two. What stands out about Kenny Pickett? Things that we might yeah. not know from the limited action we yep. saw from him last year and obviously going back to his college days. I mean, yeah, as, as you guys can tell from his college days and now he's a winner. Um, he's going to put the game, hit himself on the line every single game and, you know, the way he gets us, you know, going in the, in the, in the games and even before, um, he's a great leader and a great quarterback and I'm excited to get rolling with him. All right, lastly, I want to build the perfect tight end with you if you're yeah. up for it. Yeah, so sure. the idea here is I'll provide an aspect of a tight end and yep. You pick a player yeah. that maybe has that as that portion of it. Okay. So let's start with size. Size. Ooh, uh, I'll probably go with Dallas Goddard. I think that he's 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 big and he's, he's smooth and he's probably the size guy. And I should say it can be past tight ends too. Yes. yes so I, I don't want okay. you to have to yeah, yeah. rack your brain on all yeah. 32 right yeah. now. Uh, speed. Uh, probably Kelsey. Kelsey with his speed. Um, yeah. Hands. I'm going to go myself. I think I have some pretty Love it. Hands, I was, so, yeah, absolutely. Drop that in there. Yeah. Uh, route running. Uh, so I'm going to go with Kelsey again. Yeah, <laughs> Kelsey, he's a hell of a route runner. Blocking. Uh, I'm going to have to go with Gronk. Um, I think Gronk was a hell of a blocker. An underrated blocker, underrated. too. Underrated. Yeah. All right, and lastly, just playmaking. Uh, playmaking, I'll probably just go Kittle. I think that he makes plays in the run game and the pass game, and uh, he, he gets things going. Pat, thanks as always yeah, for the absolutely. time, man. Good to see you. Good luck this year. Thank you. And our CBS Sports training camp tour continues after the Cards and the Steelers. We got double duty again with the Bengals and the Bucks, Dolphins and the Titans on August 4th. And August 6th, next up there is the Jets.